what's happening, my people? So, I'm trying to put y'all on game right now, man. <sighs> shit, feeling good, just solar painting and shit. It's two o'clock in the morning. Did a transition like a, like a uh, like a gangster, like a dope dealer in the night. But before I did that, I was chilling. I was watching this movie. Beats on Netflix. Put y'all on game. If y'all ain't seen this movie, watch this movie, dog. Look, this movie, this movie cold. This the co the coldest hip hop movie since since Hustle and Flow. To me, did this. It's real good, man. It's about by this little kid, this little kid in the south side of Chicago. And so he he got PTSD. He going through a lot of things, man. He's stuck in the house. He don't want to leave and what whatever. They got somebody at the school. And so he doing security and stuff, but uh his his uh soon to be ex wife is the principal at the school and whatever. So he kinda trying to get in her good graces and they need a certain number of students or something to come back to the school to, or else they're going to drop off funds for programs and school and this stuff. So he goes to the to different people, different people houses and whatever. He, he meets this kid. So he hear, he hear the, uh, the music and stuff playing in Homeboy Phenomenal. But the reason why he got PTSD, his sister got killed. And it, it messed him up. It messed him up in the head. So, is she speaking of hustle and flow? She, Anthony Anderson was in hustle and flow too, and he was kind of like the manager dude. So it's yeah, it's kind of the same thing. So he go go to the, the kid, and so he he trying to kind of like help him out. So the kid has, has a lot of things to to go through, like to try to get back into civilization, get back into into the world. Like he he. he shell shot and so Anthony Anderson kind of wanted helping him a little bit but then he's like an ex-manager back in the days and he he fucked over somebody back in the days and so he trying to redeem himself so it's there two different stories meeting up and this movie this movie is phenomenal dog this movie is good at the end at the end I shared I shared the Denzel tear but I said on like almost all my movie reviews because I cry on movies <laughs> but this this is tea. This is tea. I ain't I ain't sipping on nothing crazy. But uh, I would say watch this, man. I just want to make this video just to tell y'all watch this movie. Not like I'm getting paid for it or something. Where well, I do put ads on my videos. So if this dude it hit a million, let this hit a million. I'm gonna get paid, and we all gonna be happy. But watch this movie, man. If you got Netflix or you can find online or whatever. Look, peep this movie out. This movie, it is it is real dope, man. I just wanted to make a quick video of it and give you a quick little synopsis. I ain't wanna I don't wanna spoil it or nothing. Like it's just details and them meeting up and how it's affecting the dude life and how it's affecting Anthony Anderson's life and the dude mother and people around the community and stuff and how they different paths are crossing in everything. But it's a redemption story. It, it is real good, man. Check that out. So don't need to make this any longer. Watch that movie. Beats on Netflix. I let you boy, man. Peace out.